Don't push me to stand, okay? Look here, Look here, please. Look here. Look here. Look here, please. Bye, bye. Yes, Thank you. And uh, I want to thank thanks uh, Mr. Arbaz Khan who came all the way from Bombay for this occasion. So thank you Arbaz Bhai. Thank you Ms. Laila. Thank you Hussain. Thank you so much. So please, can I ask media whatever question they want to ask please. Thank you.
question? Hi, good evening. Uh, Nipun from Comedy TV, India. And uh, we have a lot of exclusive brand showroom across UAE. Then uh, you have started a multi brand under a roof. So, what is the specialities you are differentiating from other exclusives, or what is the specialities you are differ differentiating from others? Thank you for your question. I think this is the first kind of outlet in UAE a multi-brand outlet, which you don't see. I mean, there are outlet mall here in Dubai LM and then and, and, and also on the Sheikh Zayn Road. But this is the first multi-brand outlet where you get all the fashion, anything what you can wear, at discounted rate, at uh, maybe for money concert. So this is especially that all the brands at one, under one roof, at discounted rate, this is the only outlet called Brands for you. Can you just brief us, like, uh, what is the uh, offers you have, like, like 50 percentage, or how how is it works? Offer is uh, various. It starts from 40 percent, which is minimum, and it goes up to 75 to 80 percent discounted. Depend on the item, depend on the category, depend on the season. What season we are selling? Maybe some stuff from last season, which we are also giving away 60, 60 percent discount. Thank you. Thank you.
How many of brands you have here in Dubai brands for you? Uh, and the concept brands group, we've been doing event. I'm sure most of the media people have been coming to our event and uh, I'm sure most of you know we do events in World Trade Center. We started doing event in 2004, that was the first event. And now we are doing across the region. Last time we did it in Oman and we did it in Kuwait, we did it in Bombay also. So after that we realized that customers are always waiting for the discount. And especially business retail is bit down. So everybody is looking value for money. So we thought why don't we have our own outlet where customers can come all the time and have the offer all the time. So we opened first outlet in uh, Reef Mall in 2017 November, which was inaugurated by Consul General of Philippines, Mr. Paul. And then we opened one in Abu Dhabi, then we have an outlet mall. This is the first store in DFC. It's a multi-brand and the biggest outlet we just opened. So we have four outlet, but we have a plan to open more outlet. We are open in, opening in Oman and we are opening two in Abu Dhabi and maybe God's blessings, maybe this year in Bombay also, we are coming to open. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. Assalamu alaikum. Firstly, let me say that it is all. Uh, thank you for being here in such large numbers and you know, uh, facing this occasion. It means a lot to all of us. Uh, uh, I would also like to thank uh, Mr. Vijay for making me part of this very important day of his life. Uh, the grand opening of his grand Kuyu uh, store and his fourth in Dubai at the moment and he's got other plans as well. I also would like to wish him, today happens to be his birthday, so it's an auspicious birthday. Uh, so it's great to be uh, you know, doing something like this on a wonderful occasion like this. Uh, to answer your question, uh, I'm a very frequent uh, visitor of uh, Dubai. I love the city, I think it's home away from home. And I keep coming very often. I love the people, I love the place, I love the, you know, the hotel, the food, the shopping, everything. Uh, as far as uh, me, I'm not so much of uh, like, you know, br uh, kind of like one particular brand. I like a lot of brands. Uh, so it all depends on season to season. Yeah, but uh, I guess the most of the supposed top brands, I either buy shoes from one of them or clothes. I like the clothes of one of them. I maybe like uh, belts from one of them or watches from one of them. So it's pretty much varied. So I think different brands provide you for different uh, kind of accessories that you tend to like, yeah. Uh, please feel free to ask questions. We are here for you all. And don't feel shy. Anything that you want to know, please ask us. So, you know, so anybody has a question for Laila, so please ask her. She's also here to answer some of your questions. I want to thank you for the uh, Vijay that you invite us uh, first to meet all the people and for this outlet and to meet Ambassador. I'm happy that we are with you. Hello. And I want to tell you that happy birthday. Thank you. I wish thank you a long One question to Mr. Abbas Khan here. Uh, I just want to check which is your upcoming movies and how is the movie industry doing back back in India? Well, I guess the uh, movie industry is uh, doing well only. It's going from strength to strength, if you notice. Uh, Bollywood films are now becoming very popular worldwide. They're having a market all over. Uh, all over. And in the terms of business, they're doing some pretty really remarkable business which today pretty much easily do 200 crores, 300 crores also at times. So the market is booming and uh, you know the kind of quality of films all this year has become very good. Uh, today there's a, there is a, like 
different kind of cinema. Like recently we saw a movie called Razi. You know, it was a sensible and an entertaining cinema. And there's a tendency to make entertaining cinemas that kind of compromise on logic. But there are a lot of films that are being made in India which are interesting films and yet commercial, even though they may not have the supposed commercial elements like song and dance or fights or, you know, item songs or whatever. So there is one section of Bollywood that caters to the typical Bollywood masala. And there is also a good section of Bollywood that is now doing very good content-driven cinema and which is getting a lot of appeal worldwide. So yes, things are good. As far as my uh, uh, scenario is concerned, I last year happened to do uh, about six films as an actor. There are two films which are still to be released. Uh, and I'm also now on way to start filming of the Bang 3, my project, with Salman and, uh, you know. So that will happen sometime in uh, October. Uh, apart from that, I think Dabang will take a lot of my time and, uh, you know, concentration. So I would like to concentrate on that, Dabang 3. And then hopefully after that, uh, there is, I want to explore things like, uh, you know, maybe make other films, maybe smaller budget films, or uh, even explore web series. So that's a part of my plan. But I like to go slow. I like to go one step at a time, you know, tackle my first goal. So uh, as of now, I know I've got a big thing on my hand, Dabang 3. I don't want to get diverted to other things. So that's what I'm concentrating on. Declaring for double click. Thank you so much. Uh, Mr. Paul, one uh, question to you. Uh, how do you feel the group is catering to the needs of the Filipino community in this region? Can you say that again? How do I feel? The store is okay. catering. Well, uh, I got to know VJ about two, two and a half years ago. And since then, the, the score has grown leaps and bounds. So I'd like to think I'm a good luck charm to VJ. Happy birthday, VJ, by the way. <laughs> but the concept of value for money is something that is very important, not only to the Filipinos, but to everybody in the UAE who are very hardworking and make sure that whatever it is that their money buys is something that is much worth it. And in a world that has seen a lot of uh, beautiful brands and beautiful uh, items come out, sometimes that are out of reach for the ordinary uh, worker, brands for you gives them a chance to enjoy wonderful pleasures like the ones being uh, on display right here at the store. Not only that, it allows a sense of, um, of beauty to people who think that it may be out of reach from their own hands. And uh, good thing we have, we have a store like Brands for You that allows uh, other individuals who may not be in the sort of reach as financially uh, to enjoy wonderful products, quality products that may be of uh, worth and of use, not only for them but for their families back home as well. And uh, we're glad that the uh, store has grown, as I said, leaps and bounds in the past two and a half years or even more, goes to show that more and more people believe in that concept of value for money. Thank you. One uh, question to Ms. Laila also. I think you were there last time in, the, in one of the events earlier. And I'm seeing you again for the second time. So you are also a lucky champion, Mr. Vijay? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think you Actually, I would like to thank Mr. Vijay because I'm always with him. I'm always supporting him. Uh, he's, not, uh, he's like my brother. So I'm always with him, supporting him with every event. Uh, whenever he will be there, I will be there with him. I've heard you both sing yourself and Solomon. Do you think you're a better singer than Solomon? <laughs> <laughs> See, everybody who sings believes that he's the best singer. So that's the pretty much a, Yeah, I think Salman has been singing now. He's done some songs. He's recorded some playback songs. I'm a better singer. I can vouch for him. I can vouch for him. A lot of... Okay, if you're a better singer, then you can give me one nice song to sing. Okay. Have you seen this movie? Have you seen some of our films, Indian Bollywood films? Have you seen some of our Bollywood films? Yeah, you've seen you've seen Dabang, 
Excuse me, Arbas, sorry to cut you off. Before you could suggest, uh, take a song. It's Vijay's birthday today, so you can sing something for him if you want. <laughs> Actually, I'll sing a song, it'll be for his birthday only. I've heard. Okay, I'll sing two lines of my movie. Ready? So you can shut your ears if you want. This will, you have to tell me after this song, did I sing better than Salman or not, okay? You decide that. <clears throat> ताकते रहते तुझको सांझ सवेरे नैनों में बसिया जैसे नैन ये तेरे नैनों में बसिया जैसे नैन ये तेरे तेरे मस्त मस्त दो नैन मेरे दिल कले गए थे मेरे दिल कले गए थे must must go now. Wow. It's okay, don't compare the two brothers, we both are okay. <laughs> if he comes to know that he, I, I sing better and you said that, he won't like it. <laughs> I'd say, I'm postponing the one for you. <laughs> Which is not working. <laughs> No, but in the movie, who sang the song? You did or no, no, no. This was sung by Sir Gadar Sai. Hi, I have a question for Ms. Laila. Are we going to see you in any Indian movie soon? Looking forward. Arbaj sang the song for, from his movie, so Lela is going to do the same thing from, I don't know, from her movie or another movie. So can we have a big round of applause for Lela and the party? She's going to sing too. Thank you. And actually I am making my best so that my, the turn should come to me as well, you know. Okay, I'll sing a song. I know the meaning of the song, but maybe your wife will judge us. This is for you. <laughs> मेरी जिंदगी में अजनबी का इंतजार है क्या करूं अजनबी से मुझ प्यार वो अजनबी जाना बे जाना सपनों में उसका है या ना जाना आ अजनबी तेरे लिए it was so <laughs> lovely. Oh, that's so lovely. Thank you so much. I think the biggest uh, birthday gift I so far received, I think that's the biggest gift for me on my birthday. Thank you so Thank you much. Thank you. <laughs> so, can we have a few words from Mr. Paul also, please? Song goes. Oh, well, Vijay, congratulations again on the wonderful. Uh, no, so we are expecting a song from you. <laughs> <laughs> Can we have a big round of applause for all the Filipino community? Okay, what do you want me to sing? I don't know, whatever you want. Everything I selected for you. Look into your eyes, you will see 
what it means to me. Search into your heart, search your soul. When you find me there, you search no more. Don't tell me it's not worth fighting for. I get help in, there's nothing I want more. You know it's true, everything I do, I do it for. Wow. Well, <laughs> thank you, Mr. Paul. Thank you so much. Now you're training. <laughs> 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 Have a nice voice. I know my voice. <laughs> well, as I said that uh, I was making a bass while I'm, I will sing, even though you asked me no, but I'm going to sing a song. <laughs> because I have to reply to Laila. I have one of Arba's first movie, which I love it, not because I know him. So I'm going to sing a song from his movie. Divana, 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 Tere liye. Tere aankhon ka divana, divana, divana. Tere baaton ka divana, divana, divana. Tere har da ka main jaane man jaane ja main divana, 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 divana. Thank you, Lala. Thank you, Arman. Lala, just be nice. Well, thank you so much, all of you, for coming all the way. And uh, again, I thanks our dear friend Arbazi. I'm looking forward to see all his movie. And Lela, so yours. And uh, we are going to do the cake cutting ceremony. And uh, oh, please, there is the occasion. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yes. Can I request all family members to please come close by? Yeah, mommy, can come, come, come. That's my daughter. Mommy, Nisha, Sanu, come. Pridhibai, Vasan, Sunny, all, all of you. Can we request all family members, please? No, no.
Happy birthday! 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 Happ